Heathrow has two runways, the northern and southern runway. Most of the time, one runway is used for arrivals and one for departures. The direction that aircraft fly depends on the wind direction. Aircraft have to take off and land into the wind. For about 70% of the time at Heathrow, the winds are from the west. During these times, aircraft will approach over London to land and take off towards the west. This is known as westerly operations. When we have easterly winds, this reverses and aircraft land from the west and take off towards London. This is called easterly operations. When we are on westerly operations, we usually use one runway for arrivals and one runway for departures and then switch over halfway through the day. This is called runway alternation. This gives residents living near the runways relief from aircraft noise for half the day. When we are on easterly operations, we don't currently alternate the runways. This is because of the Cranford Agreement, which prevents the use of the northern runway for takeoffs in an easterly direction. The trial will explore how Heathrow's runways and airspace can be used in a more efficient and flexible way to help to maintain the schedule. Heathrow already utilises some additional measures to deal with delays. For example, when a build-up of arriving aircraft causes severe delays, air traffic control can land aircraft on both runways. These measures do not give the flexibility necessary for the airport to maintain the schedule, especially following disruption caused by bad weather. Delays often build up in the holding stacks around Heathrow or on the ground at the airport, causing delays to arrivals and departures. In the first phase of the trial, Heathrow will explore how delays and disruption can be reduced by the further use of dual arrivals. This could improve punctuality for passengers and reduce aircraft emissions by cutting down aircraft holding times in the stacks. For the first time, the airport will also trial the use of dual departures. This could also improve punctuality and has the potential to reduce the number of late-running flights after 10.30pm and bring benefits for local residents. These procedures will never be used together and will only be used for limited periods.